One one pitch. Swinging a fly ball deep to center. Hernandez at the wall. That ball's gone. And the Braves are going to the playoffs. It's a two run bomb for Freddie Freeman. I'm Eric Heiss with the MLB.com FastCast. Freddie Freeman clinched a playoff spot for the Braves on Tuesday with a two-run walk-off shot, carrying Atlanta over Miami 4-3. The Braves also won Chris Medlin's 22nd straight start to tie a major league record. What an incredible outing tonight by Anibal Sanchez. Anibal Sanchez went the full nine for the Tigers on Tuesday, tossing a three-hit shutout, striking out 10 in the process. The win has Detroit tied with Chicago atop the AL Central. Because the Indians scored three runs in the fourth as the White Sox failed to turn a double play to end the inning, helping Cleveland slip past Chicago 4-3. The Twins rallied back to beat the Yankees 5-4 with a four-run seventh inning. Denard Spann highlighted the seventh with a two-run double. New York remains a game and a half up on Baltimore in the AL East as the Blue Jays blank the O's 4-0. Aaron Laffey earned the win, tossing five and two-thirds scoreless. And that baby is gone! 3-2 A's! The A's snuck past the Rangers 3-2 in extras thanks to a solo shot from George Kataris in the 10th. Oakland is now a half game behind the O's for the top AL wildcard spot. The Angels remained two games back of Oakland for the second spot in the AL wildcard thanks in part to Zach Greinke who struck out 13 batters in only five innings. The Angels pitchers combined to strike out 20 batters in the nine inning affair, setting a new club mark while also tying a major league record. David Price earned his 19th win of the year with a complete game 13 strikeout performance, pitching the race past the Bo Sox 5-3. Tampa Bay's six game winning streak has them three games back of Oakland for the second wildcard spot in the AL. Jaime Garcia fanned five and seven scoreless as the Cardinals shut out the Astros 4-0. They now lead the battle for the second wildcard spot in the NL by four and a half games. Johnny Cueto tossed seven innings of two-run ball to pick up his 19th win of the year as the Reds doubled up the Brewers 4-2. Edinson Volquez helped the Padres get by the Dodgers 2-1, tossing seven scoreless frames. First major league hit is a home run for Darren Ruff. Darren Ruff hit out his first major league home run to help Cole Hamels pick up his career-high 16th win of the season as the Phillies foiled the Nationals 6-3. The Pirates beat the Mets 10-6. Pedro Alvarez hit on a three-run home run in the win. David Wright tied the Mets all-time hits record with a two-run single in the seventh in the loss. Paul Goldschmidt had a career-best five RBI, taking Tim Lincecum deep for the fifth time in his young career to lead the D-backs past the Giants 7-2. And the Rockies rolled the Cubs 10-5 in a rain-shortened seven. Willene Rosario and Matt McBride both hit out home runs in the win. For complete highlights from all the action on Tuesday, stay locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.